Hey guys, what's up? Synergy here, and welcome to some domination on the map dig site. And it's a pretty exciting one for you guys, so we're just going to get into the gameplay. You can see all the cards that are being used are the amp cards, nothing majorly special, and prosthetic legs. She's just going to allow that player to get there a little bit quicker. Now the good thing about this map is it is quite exciting, the only thing is the B flag is very contested um, so what you will end up doing is you will get killed off a lot of satchel kills guys, it's just a matter of not caring about the deaths, if you want to hold that B flag down you just got not got to care about dying basically. Ok so we got contested, you can see him up there at the minute on C, I'm going to neutralise again, not sure where he is. Extended up our grenade in ourselves. So we're currently holding down A, B, and we're capping C. Just gonna chase this guy down. Unfortunately, we don't pick up the kill and we get killed from behind. So that leaves us with the pull rank card left. <clears throat> so we're currently holding A and B, 53 to 17. These guys are giving us a pretty good game. Pilot, your Titan will be ready in two minutes. Now you're going to see me playing with one of the players a little bit. And you're going to see exactly what I mean by that. As I go to chase down that pilot there, there was another pilot hiding under the stairs, which is pretty sucky to be honest, but he's doing his job, he's defending. So well played to him, we'll give him that. Okay, so you see the pilot right up there, I'm going to double out grenade, we'll take out that one there, and I get satchel charged from above. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pile the pressure back onto A, and it's going to be me and Grim that goes into there. Take out a few of these grunts, see if we can get it neutralised. Okay, so we got secured. B's being taken at the minute, so I'm just going to rush straight over there. Like I said, guys, if you want to cap a flag, you're just not going to care about your deaths. Obviously, you want to take out as many as you can. See him up to the left there, I didn't notice him there, and I pay the price for that one with the satchel charge kill. Just choosing my classes. Got the triple threat triple threat for the reason that I can solely just clear it out, force the pilots to get away from that. Control transferring to pilot. And as you see here we're just going to spray a few cluster missile and we're going to spray a few of these straight into B. We're going to allow our pilots to cap it if they possibly can. And we're stuck, I almost get killed by a, a enemy titan though. Which was pretty damn lucky to be honest with you. Okay, so my titan's taking heavy damage. I'm a bit boxed in because of this guy right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to nuke eject. Straight down into B. We've got contested. Where is that? There he is. And we'll take out Andy MC. So now that we're capturing it, we're going to be expecting them just to come to us. And we're actually going to wall glide here a little bit. Well, wall hang. Okay, we got contested yet again. Now, since we got contested, what I decided to do is get straight over into C and start neutralising. Right, so we're neutralising C at the minute. Got contested, Grim shooting, and Grim's taking him out. Hard point secure on C. But they have given us a warning saying that there are enemy pilots that are quite close by, so what we're going to do is we're just going to hold it down. Got a nice little lead here, we don't want to sacrifice that. And this is the guy that I end up playing with, guys, Andy MC, and we're going to teabag, 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 teabag right in his ass. Now, don't worry, guys, that does get better. He comes back for revenge. Let's see how he does. Chewie Hewitt's brought in an amp charge rifle, so he's after taking out the Titans. 
See Andy Hewitt right on the floor right there. I'm just going to jump over, take him out there. So we took him out for a second time in a row. Got our Titan which we've just placed onto auto mode so our Titan will give us a heads up if they're on the right hand side. As you can see they're going through the centre of the building. That's how we know he's right there. And we take out Andy MC and we teabag him yet again. Auto Titan's just picked up a pilot kill as well. Well played my son. 245 to 137. My job is basically holding down C as long as I possibly can. Now I'm actually, I've moved to the outside here which is quite clever to do so because I know the guy's going to come through here eventually. Let's see if it proves to be correct. Just having a look around, seeing if I can see him. Can't see him, that's a Spectra. Now that I've shot though, I'll give away my position on that particular part. So I'm just moving around and I'm going to use this little wall right here. Give me a nice little view. If he comes up the stairs, I can see him. Most people won't expect you in specific parts. There he is, up the stairs. And we'll take him out yet again. And the MC again. Come on, bro, get your revenge. I am sick of teabagging you. <laughs> um, yeah, I know that's pretty lame to do, guys, but it is fun. Okay, so this time I've moved on to the outside, and let's see if he goes exactly the same way again, and if he is, very predictable. Just moving back in to see, you can see we've still got it secured, we're on 379, 380, and we've got contested, so we know there's somebody in here. Question is, where is I? Being careful, having a look around. Got the victory, right, checking under the stairs. There he is. And we take him out yet again. So I'm just going to jump over to him. And unfortunately, I've been hit marked as well, so there's not just Andy MC there. There is somebody else there, and as I'm teabagging him. There he is. And we take out a new player called Vemek. And then we absolutely get home because there was two more coming to us. Did not expect that one, guys. And we're just going to show you the dropship evacuation. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. If you do like the videos, you can see Higher Dream going on a killing spree there. As well as Boss Monster with the 14 and 11. Cartrid remains with the 8 to 3. Kill death ratios. Not, not too shabby, to be honest, for you. Peace out.